With PowerPoint 2010's bookmark feature, what you can do is set triggers to jump to certain parts of your video. So let's take a look and see how that works. So we're in our PowerPoint slide here. And what we want to do is we want to set it up so I click on this button here and that's going to jump to a part of the video that plays birds. And so what I have is I've got a couple of bookmarks in here and if I go to bookmark number two, you can see that plays the birds. So I don't want anything else to play. When I click this button, I want just the birds to play. So what I want to do is I click on my object, I select the bookmark, then I go to the animations panel and you'll see that there's a seek feature. So I can click seek. And what that's going to do is it assigns that animation one which is going to bookmark uh, number two. So now what I want to do is set it up so that when I click on this rounded rectangle the bookmark's going to play. So I click on my, my video and I go to trigger and then what I want to do is on the click of the rounded rectangle that's going to play the first animation. So let's preview that. So I click on birds and what should happen is birds should appear and that's how easy that is.